What's up everyone, it's me, Ashton Kamian. Let's talk about the war to Ukraine or the Russian invasion about some news. Hey guys, this is me, Ashton here. Sorry if I'm, guys, I did told you guys last week I'm going to make a video on the anniversary of, of the Ukraine war. And I'm sorry if I did not because I've been busy with life and stuff. And sorry about my voice sound a little funny. I'm just a little sick. And yeah, just, just the weather. Don't worry, where I live, just uh, clean skies. Just rain and stuff. Anyway, just wetter. Sometimes wetter do make you get sick. Anyway. And I want to tell you guys something about the news in Ukraine. And yeah. You guys may remember the city I told you guys called Bakuk or something. I can't not announce it right. And you guys may be whenever I post the picture of it on my YouTube channel with that post. Um, the city is almost so almost get a soakment by the Russians. And up in north, the Russian forces decided to um, get more troops and broke fuel. <laughs> and down south, good news is Ukrainians have have stopped the Russian advance. Oh, yeah, I have heard rumors on other YouTubers said the Russians are actually attacking the one high wave. The Ukrainians destroyed because I had a supply route. <laughs> and unfortunately, there's one other exit is the one of the high wave for connected um, for supply and stuff. Um, unfortunately, it's by an artillery round by Russians, and yeah, the battlefield is getting uglier for Ukraine, and, um, and it's not good for Ukraine, they may lose this city, and yeah, people are saying, saying, why Russian even attacking that city, it's not really an appointment, and yeah, and also, a lot of Ukrainian soldiers, every single day, most of them are getting killed or injured, and some rumors saying Ukrainian soldiers are pointing out, I mean, they're they're falling back or um, order to retreat or order withdrawal. And unfortunately, some might stay or two, the president's empty might actually reinforce more troops. Some some people thinking maybe those reinforcements will go in the city, just hold out, wait for NATO to send them supply and vehicles. Or some said said they're waiting for a operation to to um, doing a counter-offense to start up in north of Baku to push the Russians out. <laughs> and yeah, this is my opinion. I actually think Ukraine should have been in the city a while ago. I've never said that in the past. I actually think Ukraine should not keep their city or two could not, could not risk it to surroundment. And I just think they should get, get out. If you guys have not seen any ports, go check out those other YouTubers around. And yeah. <laughs> Get a lot of ports. Tell them about my channel if you guys want to. And yeah. <clears throat> and also I was watching some videos about crazy videos in Bakbuk. Um. Excuse me. Sorry about that guys. Um. They're showing a Ukrainian soldier. There's one guy. He was all by himself. His probably his Kumtun got. His squad or Kumtun got killed. Or probably got separated. <laughs> And so crazy, he was by himself, and he was stuck in a house, a couple of houses, because there were, I think, four or five Russian soldiers surrounding the building, and he was trying to hug her down, and um, some videos show they said it was artillery hit the Russians, or some said it was by a PTR class of Ukrainian side. It was taking out um, um, Russians, um, oh yeah. Russian industry to save that Ukraine soldier, and luckily, I think Ukraine soldier got saved because I showed that Ukraine drone was watching the fight, and it was really crazy. <laughs> and yeah, <clears throat> and in the other battle, Ukrainians are still fighting. Russians are gaining some ta some territory in some other cities when it's not that bad. And yeah, <laughs> and by the way, guys, let me know down in the comment section what do you think. Where Ukrainians might do their counterfeits. Do you think they're going to do it in spring or summer? Or do you guys think they'll start it right now? <laughs> and yeah. To me, in my opinion, is I think they should have started a little while ago in Corson region. And oh well, wars are wars. <laughs> and yeah. And and what else? Um, oh yeah, and also I heard, I think it was yesterday or other day, one of the, one of the planes, you guys may know those airplanes with those big... um. This over above their their um roof of the plane. Those for the military. they um those planes are meant for reconnaissance for or to not reconnaissance, just mean um 
telling pilots, telling other fighter pilots know where the enemies are coming. And is those kind of playing with those big radar? So crazy. In Belarus, um, um, there's one report the plane got hit by, by drones, some said. And some people were estimating it could be Ukrainians did it, or parliaments, or those people are rebels, or, or people don't believe the war, or don't think it is not right. And yeah, they decided to attack the airplane. Luckily, unfortunately, the plane landed safely, and unfortunately, um, it, they think the damage is not that bad. And yeah, <laughs> just want to let you guys know, and sure, it's really crazy. Excuse me. And also, I heard some ports, um, um, people are saying, you Russians are sending more troops in their, um, one of the, in the Russia area. The one of the part of the Russia for invading part of Ukraine. And yeah. <laughs> and people were speculating Russia going to do a invasion again on their anniversary. And nope, they did not. <laughs> Just want to let guys know. And luckily, Ukrainians are still being good. Still hanging on. And yeah. <laughs> and the NATO weapons and vehicles have not sent yet. And Ukrainian soldiers are still training with them. And yeah. Just want to let guys know. Alright guys, it's me Ash and I go out and by the way guys, hit that like button, two, hit that subscribe button, three, hit that bell button, winner where I make an awesome video. And you never, I'm not forcing you guys to do whatever you guys want to do. And you guys more feel free to comment me or ask me anything about Ukraine war, let me know. And I'll try my best to answer it. Peace out everyone.